living one day at a time, enjoying one moment at a time, accepting hardships as the pathway to peace. Tom Brackett does a wonderful John in his reflection of naming a false and often unexamined belief among many Christians that can cause great spiritual and emotional harm. My prayer is that these stories would lend us the courage to let go of our cheesy assurances of safety and protection from falling towers, if we just believe correctly, or live a sin-free life. Bad things do, in fact, happen to good people, and our faith does not exempt us from tragedy striking in our lives, or in the lives of our loved ones. Calling us to let go of these beliefs is Tom's way of calling us to let go of thinking that we are in control. Faith in God does not protect any of us from having to walk through the valley of the shadow of death. What faith in God does protect us from is being afraid. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I fear no evil. Our belief in God does not give us magical control over our lives. What it does give us is a deep and abiding trust that whatever happens in our lives, we are surrounded and upheld by the love and peace of God. As you reflect on your own faith and the prayer for today, are you aware of any beliefs that might be inhibiting you from living each day with joy? Accepting that hardships will bring you to peace? How do you reconcile belief in a loving God with the tragic events in the world, or any tragic events that have affected you directly? If you are praying the serenity prayer each day, is it offering you more peace? God bless you. This message contents something that could change your life.